Congratulations, Reading Through the Bible participants. This is our 300th day. Glory to God. I give thanks to God for each one of you and your participation in any way in reading through the Bible in a year. Let us always remember that Jesus Christ and his word are one. John 1 verses 1 through 2 says, In the beginning was the word, and the word was with God, and the word was God. The same was in the beginning with God. John 1.14 says, And the Word was made flesh, and dwelt among us, and we beheld his glory. The glory is of the only begotten of the Father, full of grace and truth. Let us remember, as we read through the Bible, let us remember a few of the reasons why it's so important that we meditate day and night in the Word of God. Romans 10.17 says, so then faith cometh by hearing, and hearing by the word of God. That hearing that said there is on a continual basis. It comes by hearing, and hearing, and hearing the word of God. Psalms 119 verse 105 says, Thy word is a lamp unto my feet, and a light unto my path. Do we need guidance? Do we need a way, which way we should go, or what we should do? Remember, God's word is a lamp unto our feet, and a light unto our pathway. John 17 and verse 17 says, Sanctify them through thy truth. Thy word is truth. God's word will set you apart from sin and set you apart unto God. Then a powerful scripture, Hebrews 4.12 says, For the word of God is quick and powerful and sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing even to the dividing asunder of soul and spirit and of the joints and marrow, and is a discerner of the thoughts and intents of the heart. Again, reading through the Bible participants, congratulations for each to each and every one of you for your participation in any way in reading through the Bible in a year. God bless you all.